Well, Walker, to paraphrase the immortal Dodgers broadcaster Vin Scully, it's time for New York baseball. That's right, baseball season is underway. The New York Mets have their opening day this Thursday, April 1st. So I drove out to NBT Bank Stadium to check in with the Syracuse Mets to see how they're planning to run the bases this year. Minor league baseball is a unique feature of America's national pastime but it became one of life's many luxuries taken away in 2020 by the coronavirus. Opening day for the Syracuse Mets is May 4th. I know, all Star Wars references aside, that's 609 days since their last baseball game. I spoke with the Syracuse Mets Director of Broadcasting and Media Relations, Mike Tricarico, about the return to baseball. After more than a year without baseball, here in Syracuse and, and really all over uh, the country. Um, we're excited to get back. I know the fans are excited to get back and, and we're excited to, uh, to be able to open also a, a newly renovated ballpark. In 2020, many minor league clubs played intra-squad games at their facilities, but the New York Mets took a different approach with their minor league roster. We actually didn't have any players in Syracuse last year. Um, all of the Mets players who were on uh, more of a taxi squad at an alternate training site, they were down in Brooklyn. You know, there's not a whole lot better than being able to, on a warm summer night, uh, go to the, the stadium, you know, grab a hot dog and a soda and sit down and, and, and watch some baseball. From NBT Bank Stadium in Syracuse, I'm Jesse Cook, Citrus TV. Right now, Syracuse is looking pretty stacked with some former Major League talent and players like Brandon Drury, Jose Peraza, Malik Smith, and a few others. They open up their season on May 4th at home against Scranton.